Take a look at Ortiz's numbers brought to you by the Pennsylvania Lottery and obviously he needs to quit giving up so many hits. They are batting 108 off of him. Yep. Got to got to cut down Get on that down. hits. And McKinstry lines that one out to center and a leadoff base hit for Chicago. Do a good job McKinstry doing a good job in the leadoff spot. Swinging the bat better as of late. Good approach, good at bats. And into center here comes Bay and he's there. It's a pop up. It's Cruz. And that's two outs. There's a strikeout for Luis Ortiz at 100 miles an hour. The leadoff hit, the pesky Kiros got him. Then a pop out and a strikeout. And G1 Bay will lead off the bottom of the first. Starting pitcher for the Cubs brought to you by Budweiser. This Bud's for you. Sampson making his 17th start of the season. Fastball slider, changeup cutter. Induces the fly ball in half under it out left one down. That's uh, inside the base at first. Rivas has it. Two down. And he's a first pitch swinger. And out to center, Michael Hermosillo. With room on the track and a one, two, three start. Five pitches from Adrian Sampson. He says, thank you very much. Strike three called. Horner almost to his dugout by the time the home plate umpire Chad Fairchild rung him up. The fearlessness, swinging a miss, struck about. There's two strikeouts. I, we can't even get a word in edgewise, Luis. <laughs> two strikeouts in the inning, three in a row for Ortiz. Here's P.J. Higgins. Oh yeah, there we go. Ten. Ten pitches. Not immaculate, but pretty close. Strikes out the side in order. Luis Ortiz. Fifteen days, got to be down there. Broken bat. Oh, look at the, the long arm of the law. O'Neill Cruz. Stab it. Two down. Wow, he looked like a like a spider going after a moth, didn't he? Look how high the ball is already. Not high enough. <laughs> Struck him out looking. Had to throw extra pitches, got it done. Seven punch outs. Ball four. I like this a lot. Pitch. Second time today, Esteban has walked and now back to back freebies. And here comes Patrick Wisdom. Wisdom straight away center back. It goes back to the track deep and gone. The Cubs strike first. Patrick Wisdom with his 25th home run, a three run home run. Cubs up three to nothing here in the fifth. He absolutely mashes this one straight away center field. That is not short out there. That's big boy power. Hayes on to first. Well, the Pirates need to score some runs and get Ortiz off the hook. Into left center field for get Hayes. Get through, get through. And he's going to get two. Oh, look at the throw. Doesn't matter. Lead off double for Cabrian Hayes. Middle of the plate, but he still had to go down and get it. Hit it well. A laser beam from Key right here. 24th double of the year. Splits the gap in left center field. A little lazy breaking ball that doesn't do a whole lot from Sampson. Bucko's got a little work to do. And Hermosillo coming on and makes the catch. Saves a run for the Cubs with that grab out in center. Here's Brian Reynolds. Has a drive to right. Forget about it. Clear the deck. Cannonball coming and anchored down for Brian Reynolds, number 26. Pirates on the board. It's three to one. What a finish to the season he is having here. I mean, is it possible? He's at 26 now. I mean, the way he's going. Could he hit 30? Could he? Why not? A lot of new guys around the division, and Wisdom gets hit by a pitch. And uh, Patrick has some words. Coming on the heels of his home run the last time he was up from a different pirate pitcher. Yeah, and you can sit here and say, oh, it's not on purpose, but 
Last time Patrick Wisdom was up, he hit a massive three-run home run. Took his time a little bit, and so you're frustrated, and he's saying, I didn't do it, I didn't do it. And then at first and second, nobody out, and the batter is Ian Happ. He lines one left center field. That's a base hit. This will drive in a run as Kiros comes in to score. Wisdom will stop at second. RBI single Ian Happ. Cubs lead 4-1. to one. Good at bat for Ian. He gets a little fastball or cutter inside, just inside outs this ball, and lofts it over, cruises head in left center field. Velasquez is the pinch hitter, and it gets through. O'Neill Cruz, it's short, and two runs will score. A bouncing ball that gets through Cruz. He tried to charge the ball, and on the backhand effort, never got a glove on it. It bounced under his leather and rolled out into shallow left center field. Two-run score. Runner goes. And out. Cruz kept the tag on. They will not challenge. Caught stealing. Good quick tag. Esteban Quiroz has reached the last three times up. A couple of walks, a single. He scored twice today. Four times in a row, Esteban will reach. And this base hit will drive in a run. Rivas comes in to score 7-1 Cubs. And a big day for Quiroz. The first time in his young career he's reached four times in a game. The throw down to third, and it goes out into left field. And another miscue defensively for the Pirates. Brings McKinstry in for the eighth run of the day. Toward left center field and caught. Be a, be, a, be a great at bat, but still you like to see him doing the things he needs to do in that scenario there. Fly ball to right. To the track. Sacrifice fly. Makes it eight to three. Two outs. Give Jack Sawinski his 33rd ribby. One two from Brandon Hughes. Out to left center. Hermo Seals got it. And that's the ball game. Cubs win. Cubs win the series. And Cubs win the season series over the Pirates.